door area is not a playground area. Okay. So that's why the crew always told that they have to come back at least 15 minutes or some 30 minutes to walk around at the galley area because there's a curtain just to monitor when they're doing something. Dinesh, how do we open a door? In a normal situation and an emergency okay. situation? In a normal situation, you don't have any problems. You manually have to push the door out and forward. In an emergency situation, when it's armed, when you put the door handle all the way up, you release and you cut the door. The door will open automatically. Shall we try that? Would you like to try the normal opening first? Yes. What you need to do first thing is, you need to check okay, the door is up. Good. Then you have to check the weight. Cabin pressure is not pressure because this is the cabin pressure in here. The cabin must be depressurized. Once you're done, check outside condition is safe. Pull on Hold this, this and one hand here. Just pull a bit and do not let go. Huh? So this thing should not illuminate. Okay. If it illuminates, you have to push it back down because there's some problem with the door. Okay. But now there's no white light. You mm -hmm. raise the door handle slowly all the way up. And now you push the door out and forward. Walk with the door. But don't walk the door outside. <laughs> I heard a quick sound. Mm -hmm. Now release this hand and cut the door here. So basically, what has mm -hmm. happened is you have opened the door in normal opening, and the click sound was this gas lock. Okay. It's like the door lock. You see now the door comes. So I need to hear the click. Correct. If you don't, when the train knocks in, the door is going to start to clear. In case of emergency, how do you open the door? So the cabin crew over here, when they hear the evacuation command, either to the PA, evacuate, 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 or they might hear this command. So they will release their seatbelt, leave everything, look outside. So that's very loud. So it's either to the event signal or to the PA evacuate zone. You will try. If not possible, you will see the structural damage, then you initiate either by shouting, either by pressing this. If some airline you can press this, some airline only the captain can press. What if the passenger is just standing there, he or she is afraid to jump? When we push. Yeah, here, here, behind yes. here. Okay. Because he might go down with a broken arm, but people will not be dying of smoke inhalation behind him. But how many seconds you got to evacuate? Only 90 seconds. You will start to push. You can 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 push. You You help! But what if a child is sitting there? They cannot find a seat. Oh, okay. They will be protected because they look at the people.